Things you also look for are the leakage of this oil that's inside the shocks or the struts, the dampers. Now, it's very common to get what's called misting. Misting is where a tiny bit of the oil leaks out, which is normal. And what will happen is the side of the damper or the shock, the shut, strock or the shut, strut, will be covered with a little bit of dust. It might actually cake up and be a little heavier. When you start seeing lines of dripping, or you can actually feel wetness on the body of the shock or strut, that's when you replace it. A little bit of the misting attracting the dust is normal. So we don't want to have people taking pictures and saying to the customers and saying, look at all the dirt collecting around your shock or your strut, ma'am, sir. That tells me I have to put $500 or $1,000 worth of dampers on your vehicle. That may not be the case. Unless it fails the temperature test or the smartphone app, or you actually see drizzling of liquid oil dripping down the sides, or of course, obviously you see holes in the side of the shock or strut rusted out, or the mounts broke or starting to rust out. That's when you're justified in replacing a shock or a strut, and that's when you take those pictures and get your customer's authorization. So those are some nice, easy, but fairly advanced tips to make sure you nail diagnostics on dampers.